So how are they truly feeling about you right now? I'm going to look at lots of different cards. We have the Ace of Pentacles. Let's look at the messages from the Heart cards. Courage. Let's look at their emotions. How are they currently feeling? Nervous. And let's look at a message card. And we're going to look at lots more of these as we go along. Please don't leave me. Okay, so this person's really trying to pluck up the courage to come towards you with an offer but they're feeling extremely nervous about this okay this person wants to communicate that they want to create something tangible with you this could be them communicating communicating their feelings about wanting to be together, wanting to work on this connection, wanting to rekindle what you've already had if you've been together with this person in the past, but they want to ground this, okay? This person is trying to work up the courage, the strength to take this leap of faith, to do what's right. They feel it's right to express their feelings to you. Bravery, confidence, going for it. They want to be this protector energy. They want to be stable. They want to be dependable. So what I'm really feeling is for some of you, their nerves or their fears of being open and vulnerable have got the better of them. And so they've either ghosted you or they've not taken action and they're fearful of you leaving them. OK, um, you may be leaving or walking away from this person because they haven't taken action or for some they're hesitant to come forward. They're feeling very uh, vulnerable to do that because they're fearful of you leaving them. They're fearful of you rejecting them. They're fearful of you abandoning them. So that is making them second guess and talk themselves out of coming forward. So let's clarify this further. We have the Knight of Wands. They feel immense passion, okay? They just really want to come forward as like this knight in shining armor. They want to be confident, okay? I feel like um, this person could be confident usually, but when it comes to you, they, they feel all over the place. They feel an emotional roller coaster, butterflies in their stomach, very self conscious, but they feel so much immense passion and desire. They're very, very attracted to you. Um, you could be hearing from this person, they could be coming in. You know, feel the fear and do it anyway is coming to mind. Um, the seven of pentacles. So, your person's done a lot of soul searching to look into what they want to invest in in the future that they're looking at what do they want their life to be like and i feel like they've come to this conclusion that they've um held themselves back or they've invested in a lot of things that are no longer serving them they're wanting a new chapter they're wanting a new beginning and they see you in this new beginning is what i'm really feeling because this is like putting this ace of pentacles to one side planting this seed in a new direction so they want to go forward with you um two of pentacles but this is where they've been struggling okay there may be something this person needs to release in the past that isn't serving again here's this emotional roller coaster i feel this is also a lot of doubts come up fears of rejection so they're like what should i do weighing up their options um, they know what they want to do, like they want to come forward, they want to confess their feelings to you, but um, they're second guessing themselves. It's like they're reading too much into times you've spent together or, you know, they're, they're finding negative things, you know, seeing things as the glass is half empty, feeling pessimistic. And, you know, feeling like, oh, this could mean that you don't feel the same way about them as they feel about you. And look at the bottom of the deck. We have the five of cups. They think worst case scenarios. They think of losing you. Um, you abandoning them. It not working out. They're not being good enough for you. All these kinds of thoughts like plague them. Normally this shows two cups still standing up right behind them though. This is the potential for this amazing connection, this amazing union between you both. But they're struggling with a lot of self-doubt. 
So let's look at some more of these messages from the heart cards. How are they truly feeling right now? Yeah, tortoise. This is someone who's in their shell, slow moving, clammed up, silent, slow and steady, withdrawn, introverted. They could be shy, insecure and wise, it says. So this is someone that has a big heart is what I'm feeling. But I feel like they felt very nervous. I'm just, as I'm talking, I'm just seeing this dice. And it's like there's two sides of them in terms of they felt like they've had to have this false self. And look, there's this one here, a false self in this world. And then the true self that has been hidden away. Um, so, yeah, definitely like a hermit kind of energy, an introverted person. They really want to come out of their shell. They could be slow moving. This is why. Maybe they're picking up on you leaving them or, or they can sense that maybe you're thinking that. How else are they feeling? Holding on. They're not letting you go. They want to be together. They can't move on. They feel lost without you. They need you. There could be some codependency. So again, holding on and please don't leave me. This person feels like you're walking away. For some of you, this is an illusion in their mind, though, because even though there's three cups built over, there's two, the two, still the two of cups. Your connection standing upright. It's like they just can't see that shatter. This is their biggest fear, like tower moments, sudden change, shocking transformations, endings, wake up call, end of an era, blessing in disguise. Maybe you are moving on from this person and it's come as a shock to them. They, they didn't see it coming. Look, this person's heart is locked up, but they want to open their heart. They feel like you're the perfect fit to open each other's hearts. They feel this is a divine union, true love. This could be soulmate or twin flame energy. Um, they feel like there's destiny, this connection. Love call is here as well, getting in touch, expressing love, telling you their feelings, missing you and reaching out. So let's look at some more. And I'm just seeing this risk taking, taking a leap of faith, trusting the divine, trusting their intuition, taking action against all odds, courage, going for it and reunion here. Wow. To inflame union, coming back together, oneness, reconciliation, meeting the one, spending time together divine marriage so yeah let's look at, at some more of their emotions right now hungry this is they're hungry for you especially if you're like moving away from them they're missing you they're pining for you they find you to be deeply fulfilling they're hungry for this reunion they're hungry to get closer to you happy and I noticed this at the bottom of this deck as well happiness you make them feel so joyous so peaceful they feel so much fulfillment and they feel like they would be completely fulfilled if you had a reunion um, they imagine a happy relationship with you enjoying each other emotional fulfillment they feel like they're on track when they're in harmony with you and they feel like you could have a very successful partnership and they're upset. They're upset that you're not together. They're upset about a separation here or if a tower moment's happened, if they've hurt you and it's made them heartbroken as well. They're upset, okay? They just really love you deeply. Let's look at some more messages, cards. What do they really want to say to you right now? I'm going for it. Wow. So another confirmation. This is the full card. Taking that leap of faith. <clears throat> I lay awake at night worrying about us. So your person's having sleepless nights. Thinking worst case scenario scenarios. And again, it's about fears of you leaving them. They know that they have to come forward towards you. Um, I'm so inspired by you, the Queen of Wands. They're inspired to take action because I feel like they see you as a go-getter. You go for what you want. You create your reality. Um, you're very good at manifesting, creating abundance for yourself. 
this is my truth. So yeah, this person is going to come forward. They are going to express their truth. So what they're going to express to you, I will fight for us. This person isn't giving up, okay? Knight of Swords. There's a determination. It's too difficult for me to come forward. There's a determination to overcome this fear or these struggles. Let me be your hero. This is success in love. Six is the number of love. Six of wands. This is success after struggles. Yeah, look, I pushed you away because I was scared. This is them, and healing is here. They want to heal this, okay? They want to make amends. They want to reconcile with you. So if this reading has resonated with you, please let me know in the comments. Give it a thumbs up, share it, subscribe. That all really helps me out with the algorithm. Thank you so much for joining me here. Take care. Bye.